girl. Hey, what's up, dude? What is up? It's your favorite work from home content creator, Marley December in the his house today. And I am back with another banger for those of you that are looking for part time work. Today is Wednesday, November 13th, 2024. And as you see here on the screen, I have an opportunity for you with the company Work Care. They are looking for a part time drug and alcohol compliance coordinator working on Saturday and Sunday from the hours of 7.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is in the Administrative and Support Services Department. Of course, it's regular part-time, working fully from home anywhere in the United States. And this is your job number here. All right. Now, we're going to enlarge this just a little bit because your girl's eyes are at a certain age and reading tiny text is not her thing we are not about straining the eyes so to make this easier for me we're enlarging the screen and i hope that you don't mind that all right so let's go ahead and get into this so the drug and alcohol compliance coordinator will provide administrative support for the medical review process you will communicate with clients donors labs and clinicians to handle drug test inquiries You'll also perform daily call center and administrative duties related to drug testing compliance, documentation and process control, as well as vendor issues. For this particular position, you need a medical review officer assistant certification. However, if you do not have it, you have three months to obtain that certification. Also, prior drug and alcohol compliance experience is strongly preferred but not required okay these are some of your responsibilities you'll work closely with the mro vendor clients clinicians and other stakeholders to ensure documentation accuracy and time efficiency for all results you'll document detailed information related to client donor interaction and review detailed issues you'll also answer phone calls and or emails from clients donors clinicians and laboratories relating to results, testing, documents processing, reporting, and other issues. You maintain the process required for a compliant medical review and assist in the resolution of issues related to that process. You'll coordinate receipt of source documents with the MRO. You'll resolve questions, inconsistencies, or missing data on the documents under review. You compile, sort, and verify accuracy of all results in the MRO review process. You request documentation from vendors, clinics, or clients as required to complete the review process. You receive and review custody and control forms to identify correctable, potentially fatal, and fatal flaws requiring the cancellation of drug tests. You perform extensive follow-up with the client and other co-workers to ensure completion of review in a timely manner. You will address medical confidentiality and information disclosure issues, and you will also perform additional duties and assumes additional responsibilities as identified by supervisor for the efficient operation of work care. Your qualifications should be as follows. A high school diploma or GED equivalent is required, as well as post high school education in business, healthcare, or related field, preferred but not required. Also, mentioning again the medical review officer assistant um, certification. And if you do not obtain that certification within a three month time frame, that will result in um, your termination from the position. You should have knowledge and or experience in the field of drug and alcohol collection processes. It's strongly preferred, but not required. And this position also requires strong interpersonal skills to communicate with clients at all levels, as well as strong attention to detail. Some of your skill competencies should be as follow. You should be able to demonstrate the ability to maintain privacy and confidentiality. This is very important because you're dealing with people's personal health information. So not having anyone standing near you while you're working or you not mentioning the information to other people that you know is very, very critical when performing the duties of this job. All right. 
You should be able to demonstrate civility. Employees shall work well under pressure, meeting multiple and sometimes um, competing deadlines. And the employee shall at all times demonstrate cooperative behavior with colleagues, supervisors, and clients. You should have the ability to create and edit written materials, as well as the ability to communicate effectively to all varieties of audiences. You should have strong time management, organizational and follow through skills, as well as having a regular and predictable attendance and punctuality when it comes to work. Your computer skills, you must be competent in the Windows operating system environment, Adobe Professional, Microsoft Office Suite, which includes Outlook, Word, Excel and PowerPoint, and you should have the ability to learn other software when and or as needed. Your physical demands from this work. So you're working from home, which will require you to sit for long periods of time because it's a remote position and you're working from home and you're not really doing some of this other stuff where you are scanning or working through the office. I'm sorry, walking through the office, um, exchanging um in conversation with other employees or documents. Um, and then of course the manual de dexterity of using a calculator and as well as a keyboard and mouse. Your work environment, um, of course you're working from home. So your the noise level is definitely moderate unless you have a dog or something, which should be in another room or you have other family members. They should also be in another room. Your air quality, you control that. So you don't have to worry about um, the air quality of another building, but your work environment must be free from background noise as well as distractions because one, you're dealing with people's personal health information. And um, just due to the simple fact that you are speaking with clients, this is um, personal health information and you're wanting to make sure that everything that you input is as accurate as possible if not 100% accurate, all right? Some additional job information, we already know the schedule, which is what they're speaking on here, so we won't go over that. The salary for this position is 18, I'm sorry, 16 to $18 per hour, and that is just based on your skill set, um, your experience, and so forth. They are an equal opportunity employer, and of course, as we see here, they do offer 401k for this position. If you are interested in applying for this position, the link will be down below in the description box. If this is something that you're not interested in, but you know someone that is, please feel free to share this information with them. Thank you for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Turn on your post notification bell so that you're notified each time I post lovely opportunities like this and or similar to this. Thank you for thumbsing up the video. Leave me a comment down below and don't forget to share the video out with others whom you think may be interested. You guys have an absolutely amazing day. And as I always say, be happy for what you have while you work towards what it is that you desire. I'll see you tomorrow.